I'm excited to be back finally. It's been a minute since I've done a video. We're usually busy with homeschooling and stuff, so I don't film very often, but I'm glad to finally be back at it because um, the What's in My Bags are my most favorite videos ever, no matter what's going on on YouTube. I always go back to those. And So anyway, here it is. And it's kind of smaller than I like to carry around normally. I like the big old, like, never full dupe. That's my most favorite bag ever. But I wanted to lighten up a little bit for spring. So if you feel me and you like to carry a bunch of stuff and you're happy knowing that you have everything with you. But, you know, sometimes you have to lighten up a little bit and have to make better use of your smaller bags. Um, then just keep watching. So this is, I think, a No Boundaries brand. Um, I got it at Walmart a couple of years ago, so you probably won't be able to find the same print anymore, but I've seen lots of videos on new Walmart merchandise and stuff, and I'm pretty sure they have these type of bags all the time. And they really hold a lot of stuff, too. Uh, I have a couple of pockets on the sides here. Normally I would keep my phone here. And I just keep some hand gel right here. And I have to talk about this little clip for a minute. So, my Aunt Betty used to make these for my daughter to wear in her hair when she was younger, you know, and liked being all um, dressed up and everything. And um, she got tired of using it for that, and I didn't want to put it away. And I thought it would be cute on here, and it reminds me of my Aunt Betty, too. All right. I have a pocket down here, and so I'm going to start with that. Just have some Tic Tacs. Normally, I would rather have icebreakers, but, you know, this is smaller. It fits in here better. And I have a lipstick crayon. I'm not sure um, what brand or color this is, but it's the one I'm wearing right now. And if you're curious about that, since I can't see well, you know, I can't read it too well right now. But um, if you want to know, leave me a comment and I'll look at it a little bit better and let you know later. And this. Uh, anyway. <laughs> and Burt's Bees. Always got to have Burt's Bees. I always like the, um, the regular mint one better than any other kinds. And it's just a Bath and Body Works coupon. And a pen with a stylus. I've seen people mention that they like to keep a stylus in their purse so they don't have to touch the keypad, you know, for when you um, run your credit cards. And I forget, but at least I have one in here in case. And this is an e.l.f. Um, eyeshadow crayon. I really like these. It came from Ulta, and I want more colors of this because. You know, it's smaller, and I don't like to keep powder eyeshadow in my bag because I'm kind of rough with it. I may break it or something, and this is just a crayon, and so I don't need a brush or anything with that, and I like it a lot. And this is L'Oreal, let's see, I think it's this way. This is L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. And if you have little sparse lashes like I do, this works very well. I like it a lot. It's one of the best ones I've ever found, but I just, the wand is very flimsy. That's the only complaint I have. But anyway, let's work with it because it's a really good mascara. Just some um, sweet tarts in here. And last thing in this front pocket is a chain that my mom made for me.
on then I can put that on there and it feels so much better okay now these these are probably older than some of you that are watching this right now I bought these in the early 90s these are my very old Ray-Bans and I still love them I can't believe that they're still in such good shape but um, it's because I still have the case and I normally keep them in there but you know to save space in here I just have them inside that pocket but I think I've taken very good care of them some of the best sunglasses I've ever bought now on to this big part this is some new hemp's lotion that I just got this is the travel size from Ulta and it is um, coconut and watermelon this is some of the best lotion that I've ever used in my life and I just recently realized that after my mom gave me some of another scent for Christmas and I wish I would have known so many years ago because I've been using other brands that just dry me out and these aren't the, the scents aren't too strong and um, they just work a lot better so I'm really happy with that so if you have dry skin but you know like a sensitive nose like I do go check that out because it's not too strong have some jelly beans just to munch on when we're riding or out somewhere or church or whatever you know since it's almost Easter I thought that would be fun and a nut bar from Costco I like to have good protein snacks fill me up better these are the nails that I'm wearing right now I'll turn it around that way um, these are from Sally and they're press-ons um, they last like I've had these on for a couple weeks already and they're just starting to grow out so my nails grow pretty slow but they stay on very well and so I have these in case one happens to come off while I'm out I'll have it but I doubt that will happen because I wash dishes I do everything and they don't come off and here's my little nail kit my mama got me this cute little pouch it's pretty with all the glitter and anyway um, I like that it's clear so I can see what's in here so in case I need the clippers or um, the emery board or more alcohol prep pads you know to put on my um, press on nails and I have all this handy and this is a passport case this came with my Neverfull you've probably seen this before if you've watched any of my other videos but it just has like some of my daughter's stuff in here like she's on the insur health insurance with her daddy and so um, I keep that card in here and like she has a couple gift cards that she likes to go through at McDonald's and use, like some little Happy Meal coupons. And I also keep info on her picture and her fingerprints, because you just never know. So I feel like it's good to, to keep, you know, a little thing with her info in it. And here's a Dollar General gift card from my parents that they gave us for Valentine's Day. So thanks, y'all. Here's my Nurtec. This is a new um, dissolvable pill for migraines and it works so well. Like I take one of these and my migraine will be gone in about 20 minutes. So if you still suffer from migraines, check this out with your doctor because it's amazing. But um, it's like $1,000 if you don't apply for the savings program. So be sure you do that because thankfully I don't have to pay anything for this. So it's a blessing. Here's my Scentbird little case, and in here I have um, Vanilla Sky from Skylar. It's my my most signature scent. I'll pull out of here in a minute, so this is not the one that that I wear all the time. But I wanted to explore new scents and see what else is out there that I may like, and so that's why I like having Scentbird. Because this, um, if you like the gourmand type of scents like I do, the ones that smell more like a dessert or a food, this is like a caramel, sort of vanilla, cappuccino type smell. And so, I like keeping scents on hand in case I forget to use some before I leave the house or like if I've cooked and then I like to, you know, leave, then I have something to spray. And this is just a container that had some um, chocolate-covered sunflower seeds that I reused, and I put some mixed nuts in here. 
once again, that's a good healthy snack to have on hand. Here are some witch hazel wipes that I got from Dollar Tree. So if you're out for a good while and you wear a mask and your mask starts feeling gross and your face starts feeling gross, like after we're finished and we're on our way home, I like to use these and clean up my face and it feels so much better. Because I've had so many breakouts right around this area, like the more I wear a mask, the more problems I have. You probably know what I'm talking about. So this is just a, um, a gum, I think it's extra gum container that I reused with some uh, flossers and some little portable toothbrushes. So you know, like if you go eat Mexican or something with a lot of onions or whatever and you want to freshen up afterwards, these are very handy. And so like when we're in between here in Mississippi, I like to have these too so I can, you know, go ahead and get ready for bed. Um, by the time we get home, it's late, and so we get home, and I'm ready if I've already done all this. So then I have my keys and my wallet. This is just a little Victoria's Secret wallet. I don't think you can see any personal info here that it's enough to matter. So it's got card slots on both sides, and then... There's this little zip part. If I had any money, it would be in here, but I don't have any right now. And But I do have a little um, travel size little envelope or whatever you call it, a little thing of hand gel just in case I need that. And so I found this at Shoe Station online. And I can just, you know, if I don't want to carry my whole bag when I go out somewhere, I can just put this on and have what I need. That's just my charging cord. And there's only, I think the only place that has Meyer department stores is like in parts of the Midwest. But these little things right here are very handy if you ever see them and get you some because it keeps your cords all nice and neat and this is my signature scent right here angel i ordered this off amazon so i could have a smaller one to keep with me and i've worn this scent forever and ever it's got a vanilla um Whatever you call the types of scents that they add, like the notes, yeah, that's it. It's got more vanilla notes. Than okay, next I have just a Tide to Go pen. So we're always eating in the truck and dropping stuff on ourselves. You know how that goes. This is a little deodorant. I like having these handy too, you know, in case you need a little touch up or something. This is lavender, and you can find these at Target. It's always good to have that in your bag. Here is a Justin's. Um, this one's cinnamon. They have cinnamon and maple and other flavors, but this is an almond butter packet. Another thing that's kind of small, you know, don't take up much space and still a good filling snack. As you can tell, I love food. <laughs> and this is, I can't tell if I have it turned the right way. It goes like this. This is um, Victoria's Secret, very sexy orchid and I put some of this it's a roller ball I put some of it on earlier and it's um it's kind of a sultry musky type of scent I think it's kind of sweet too um it doesn't take much either because I did you know both places earlier and I about got a headache so it's kind of strong it don't take much but I like it because once again it's portable and I enjoy having good um, nice scents with me. Okay, last thing is this little zipper pocket right back here. Thanks to my daughter for helping me film my video because I tried to do it on my own and I'm not good at this stuff. She's a lot better at it than I am. And <laughs> I cut off my head. <laughs> so anyway, maybe this one will be a lot better since she's doing it. Okay, we have Travel Pepto. If you have anybody in your family that has a sensitive stomach, this is always great to have. So yeah, I like these types of videos because it always gives me ideas when I watch them. I'm like, ooh, I need to put that in my bag. And 
I need to give me one of those. And I have this in every single one of my, what's in my bags. It's just my pill pouch and it's divided. And I have just the regular stuff in here, some vitamins, Tums, um, ibuprofen, Tylenol, you know. Mm. But yeah, it's okay. We have feminine products in here. I don't have to show you those. And this is a little, I almost dropped it. Um, um, what's the word I need? Emergency <laughs> kit. <laughs> Can't get my words. Um, it's got just band-aids and, um, like antibiotic ointment and stuff like that in it. And, let's see. More Nurtec. I get samples of that from the doctor sometimes. What else? We're almost done, y'all. Here are some dairy relief pills for somebody that has like lactose intolerance you know if you're out and you're about to eat something that has a bunch of cheese or whatever these are handy too and I have one of these I like these a lot because they don't crease your hair and crimp it like those regular hair ties do and one more thing I think this may be, you know, there's a couple more things, but we're almost done. This is a chocolate chapstick. This came in a pack with a marshmallow one and a graham one. The graham is my most favorite ever. So it was like a s'mores pack. And I think I couldn't find it in a store, so I found it on Amazon. And then this is just Pat a Day. It's an allergy, an eye allergy drop. So you see me doing this a lot. This is a prosthetic left eye and it just tears a lot. And so this helps a little bit, but um, anyway, so yeah, this is another subject really, but if you're ever curious about things like prosthetics and have questions, just leave me a comment and ask me because I've gotten lots of questions about people that are just curious and just don't know. You know, people are just kind of misinformed or not informed and it's okay to have questions. Most people probably don't mind um, somebody asking. Okay, that is it. So as you can see, <laughs> these little bags hold a lot of stuff. And anyway, thanks for sticking with me. And I hope you enjoyed it. And in the near future, I'm going to have another video. I want to do a haul on some new spring things that I've found. There's going to be, let's see, Nike, American Eagle, um, Walmart, Amazon. It's not all clothing either. It's just a collective thing, you know, with, oh, Ulta also, of some of my new favorite things that, that I've found. Most of them have been more ordered, so I'm still waiting for them to come in. So stay tuned if you want to see that in a few days. And once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.